50 Cent speaks on how the politics that goes on in the streets of LA and how PNB Rock wasn't aware before stepping into a strange environment where he doesn't really understand how it goes then over there. Before we get into it, I want to give a special shout out to Big Boy TV for this clip I'm about to play for you guys. Go check out the full interview on his channel and smash that like button and subscribe. See your favorite African brother reporting. Check out this clip from 50 Cent. PNB is not really from here. Like, I remember when I came out here for the first time, like I was out here early, just my whole back, I, a cartoon tattoo on my back. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. Do you still have that tattoo? Yeah, yeah. It's, okay. it's just a little light now. Right, yeah. <laughs> it's old now, right? But when, when Tone did it, I was riding and he was like, this man was like, oh man, we gotta get gas. He said, what you mean you gotta get gas, fool? Is so, that yeah, car? Well, he said, he was like, what you mean? Like, yeah. I'm like, cause the neighborhood that we was in wasn't the right neighborhood to, to just get go get gas. Yeah. And I'm like, I'm from New York, bro. I didn't know which one of these gas stations that you don't go yeah. to. And it's this it's the same thing with PB. He's that he don't know exactly where he at. Big, it's not okay that to be in that there with a lot of times you watch the young boys because you'll they'll go, yo, you ever you ever go wear your jewelry? And they go, nah, I wear mine everywhere I go. Like there's not another version of them. Right. Like there's not another guy that's just not special, he's exactly like you. He just don't have a song. When you feel like you're gonna get busy if you touch it, he feeling like I'm gonna get busy to get it. Right. Right? And it this it's the same energy, bro. Like and you go on like it's when you run into yourself, you have to ask them big when they when you see them have that, nah, ain't nobody gonna do nothing with me. One thing you must understand is this, whenever you step into a new environment that you're not familiar with, you have to ask a lot of questions, right? And how can you get information on what goes on in the streets is when you ask from guys who run the streets. You get what I'm saying? So as an artist, as a rapper, a high profile rapper like PMB Rock, one thing he would have done good is to ask questions around the environment he's stepping into right he have friends he has a lot of guys who are into the rap music you know he can just dm and say what's up bro i'm about to go to so so place what do you think about the place right street guys can be able to give you full information full protection before you step into a new environment with your woman you get what i'm saying but we are not blaming the dead anyways but we are just stating the fact you get what i'm saying so that you will be careful whenever you're stepping into a new environment because these environments are not safe for you as long as you got the money, you got the jewelries on you. These guys are just looking to rob you and kill you. That's what they are out for. They got no job, they got no responsibilities, they got nothing to do with their life. They don't even care if they go to jail. You get what I'm saying? So that's why you gotta be careful. And especially when it goes to rapper, one of my advice is this. Stop wearing your jewelries everywhere you're going. If you are going for your job, which is your concert, to the studio and stuff like that, you can put on your jewelries, maybe going for a photo shoot and stuff like that. Your jewelries is like you putting on a suit because you work in a bank. You get what I'm saying? Just like a banker wouldn't wear a suit whenever, wherever he or she is going. You get what I'm saying? So the jewelries is like your job. So you are using it as a representation of this is who I am. I got the money, I got the fame and stuff like that. But you must know where your jewelry is everywhere you're going and you gotta be careful out there also. So I think that's what 50 Cent is trying to say. But go ahead and share your opinions in the comment section. Tell me what you think about what 50 just said. And don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe. Stay your favorite African brother reporting.